welcome back to more pine we're gonna go ahead and just jump right back in so see you back in just a second hi ladies and gents i have zero idea if this is going to pan out to anything but we're gonna try it anyway um oh gosh i don't have the right thing out i assume i have to do something with this <coughs> Huh. Okay. Maybe not. Don't know what I'm doing. Um. This rises up. Oh, you know what? I need to tame a little bleaker. I killed the bleaker. Damn it. There was a bleaker up here and I killed it. Ah. Here's another one. Come here, Bleaker! Good, good, good. I'm glad there was two. Alright. Come here, Bleaker! Whoa! I don't know why it kicked me off of it. Okay. So I need my Bleaker to come here. And I need my Bleaker to stay. Tell my bleaker to stay. There we go. Okay. So, and then maybe yeah, I come up here. No. Nope. I'm gonna say that's probably not it. Um. What about? Oh. Wait. I gotta get, uh, gotta get some stuff off of here. Okay. okay, I did this earlier and I found these numbers and I couldn't figure out why these numbers were here. Okay. I mean, I found these numbers earlier. And I had already marked them. Um... So one, two, three, four. Let me take a picture of that real quick. But what does that equate to is my question. So number three is the one my, my buddy's at? I must have to do them. Um, Okay. Oh, sorry. <laughs> that was my, my alarm just went off. Um, one, two, three, four. Okay. Huh. So... I mean, that's number four, though. that's one and two, and then the three, four is up top. That's not the pattern that it showed. Huh. I don't know what to say about this. I mean, there's obviously something I'm screwing up. Okay.
go. Figured it out. Alright! I don't know if it was even worth it now that we figured it out, but... Oh! Didn't mean to do that. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't realize I didn't still have this. Okay, follow me, little buddy. So, that's it. <laughs> I'm still looking for Bingo Light, and it's not going well. Alright. So. I don't think I can take this lean iron. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, pouch full. Okay. This is what I was trying to do, was to, to do this all this other stuff, but... I have just been screwing up. Okay, so we want to keep that elephant leather because we are still trying to make that shield. Let's see. We still need three more elephant leather. Man. It's, there's so much in here that's not even worth making. This would be nice to make. Bleaker antenna slick pearl, of course, as I sold my slick pearl. Uh, these hunter arm guardians as well. Uh, let's see. I think ours are better, though. This would, This tunic, though, this hunter vest would probably be good. Broadhead arrows. Let's see. We're just gonna want to make regular old arrows. Oop, that's staggering arrows. Let's go do that. Let's just make these quick. That'll help get the dull rock out of our thing too. We can make some power brew while we're at it. And get bleaker thigh out of here. Uh, I don't want to use that elephant leather. I'm really trying not to use it. And let's see what else. Let's use preservation. Oh, sure. Why not? Uh, you know what? Yeah. Let's make one of these. Alright, that should give us a little bit of room now. There we go. Perfect. So my whole goal with this is, is still, I'm still looking for Beagle Light. Uh, you can probably see there on the side, I'm still looking for three Beagle Light. Driving me a little nuts. I will need the three, um, I need at least three Beagle Light, I should say. I, I need, uh, more than that, actually, if I want to take it to Gorb as well as do my own Beagle Light stuff, but, whew, I mean, if I can get something from Gorb, it's going to be better than anything I can make, so it might be worth getting whatever Gorb has. I mean, it just depends on what his next item is, and I don't remember if he told me what his next item is, but, like, if it's a weapon, well, then I've already got a weapon that works, you know? Look, they were T-posing for a second there. Ooh. I almost died. <laughs> uh, yep, almost died. Okay. I gotta stop going the easy way down things. I'm still really confused where that spot was I found earlier. It was really early on in the game. I could probably go back through and like watch all my videos, but I have no idea what video it was in. I found like three things of Beagle Light or two things of Beagle Light, and I remember being like, huh, this must be important later on. And now it's like the only thing I want. <laughs> oh, there was like a little bridge, and there was a drop down area, and I just can't for the life of me remember where it was. Now I've finally like learned to mark my map and stuff, but. Back then, I had no idea what I was doing. This is something we could do. We could sack this caravan area. Hmm. Yeah, I just don't know. One thing I could do is once I find a place with Beagle Light, I should mark it. Which is funny, because I found one earlier, and I didn't mark it. I want to know what these are. I feel like these might be something. Like, maybe if I was in a different group or something, would they mean something? Okay, I need all the hot leather. So, I just need Oh, here, 
glitters. Oh, there we go. There's a beagle light. There's a beagle light. Okay. Let's mark this on our map. Are you kidding me? My pouch is full. <laughs> it won't be very long. Okay, let's go ahead and get rid of all these other ones that were up here. You really don't need those anymore. Okay, so we mark this one. Let me go ahead and I will do whatever I have to to get something out of here. Um, let's see. We can easily drop that. Okay. So now we know where one of the beagle lights is. Yes, okay, good, good, good. See, the thing is, once we know where at least one beagle light is, we can come back in a little while because eventually it, like, comes back. Like, it respawns. So, at least that'll help me. I remember being here before. Yeah. Okay. Alright, so I've got at least one marked off now. So, we'll keep going. You guys got any beagle light? That's really all I'm looking for. I really don't care about anything else right now. I'm kind of wondering if there isn't a way to... Not saying I'm going to do this, but I've been wondering if there's a way to game the system. I wonder if you can quit and then... Uh oh, they're going after those. I was like, wait, who are you attacking? Uh, I wonder if there's a way to quit and then respawn and if the beagle light would be there again. Whoa! What's wrong, Bubba? Sorry, my dog is barking. Hold on. Alright. <laughs> okay, guys. Uh, I'm back. I don't know what was going on with my dog. He uh, just freaked out for no reason. There was no one at the door. Um, no one in the hall. I, I don't know. I lived in an apartment building, though, so I don't know. Maybe he, like, heard someone moving around and it freaked him out or what, but... And that was like a, an alert bark, so kind of interesting that he was so nervous. But anyway, we will go ahead and continue on here looking for our beagle light. Uh, I won't make you guys follow me along too much longer. I don't want to really bore you to death. But uh, I did want to go ahead and just show you around a little bit more, talk a little bit more about this. So I am curious what would happen if I quit the game and then restarted, like reloaded all the way in because it seems like I've done that before or like I've died before right after finding a resource and then I will come back oh my gosh I almost died again well, I've noticed when I fall if I just kind of scramble toward the cliff I seem to be okay uh, if I just suddenly like come back to you know come back or whatever it, it's fine like I'm okay and the resource is there again so I don't know if maybe that's a thing you could do like is that an exploit that would work in the game I have no idea um I just don't know I don't know what would work in here I'm curious about it I don't necessarily want to do it because I kind of feel oh my gosh I kind of feel like it's cheating a little bit but at the same time I've been looking for so much that I don't know maybe I'm being silly not not doing it also I have a feeling he's just gonna keep wanting more and more beagle light this grob dude one thing I did think about was like trying to I don't know I thought about trying to look up like locations so I can make this easier on me and you guys because <laughs> I was like I don't know if I'm ever gonna get this finished because I really want to get this like I really want to be able to be prepared for this battle and in my head I was like gosh if I because I gotta record other games right now like I'm kind of taking longer on this than I normally would and I'm kind of like don't want to stop because I've gotten decent at it again like it would take me so much longer to relearn it again so I'm kind of like I don't want to stop playing but at the same time like ah, uh, I gotta I gotta play Devil's Hunt and I got all these other games I gotta play this is one of the problems with recording these and playing so many games at once I know a lot of a lot of YouTube gamers only play one or two games at a time 
because it's so hard to keep your game straight. And that's why I do bulk recording. I like try to take an entire day to just record one game. And it usually works out great for me. But when I have stuff like this where I'm just like stuck on a, like a grinding element or a collection element, it always kind of like puts you out to pasture for a day. So I'll admit, I'm just like a little bit like, oh, is there a Beagle Light walkthrough? I'm not gonna look one up, but I admit that that has crossed my mind. <laughs> oh, I am definitely gonna fall down this cliff. Uh, do I remember there being Beagle Light down here? This is near my litters. Uh, oh shit, I'm dead. Ah, yep. <laughs> well, you know. <laughs> Okay, well this will give us a good, uh, I guess, this will give us a good way to find out if there is, if that does come back. Maybe? I don't know. <laughs> that was probably really stupid. The funny thing is, it keeps saying that my, my, um, oh, we're back up here again. Okay. That my, uh, microphone is extremely loud right now, and I don't know if it is, but every time I back the video it doesn't seem that loud but it keeps saying that I'm spiking and I don't think I actually am I think this this recorder is just not as good that maybe I don't know sensing it or something this software I should say not this recorder I'm using the same headset I always use and the same computer it's just a different software oh, I must have been key there key graphite I have all these keys and I just have no idea how to how to use them because I haven't found that many chests. So there's definitely a lot of places in this game that I just have not explored or I have failed to explore, I should say. I'm gonna die. Oh my god, why am I not dead? I should totally be dead. I really should be dead. <laughs> Alright, so let's go ahead and see if this beagle light is back, because if it is. I mean, that would be kind of a big deal. Looks like it's below us. Maybe? Maybe. No? Maybe? Yes. I mean, it definitely looks like it's below us. Okay, yes, it's down there. Okay. I was like, what? Okay. Yeah, it's back! <coughs> Interesting. Okay. So I guess what we could do is we could go to Grob. We could save it. Right before we give it to Grob, we could find out what Grob's gonna make us. And then, if Grob doesn't make us something good, we could come back and make the Beagle Light Shield. I mean, I don't think that's necessarily a bad idea. That might work. I guess you could just keep dying over and over again in a spot where you know there's being a light. I really want to find that spot where there was two or three being lights before. I don't know why I can't refine that again. It's so weird how you'll play a game for a little while and then... Like when you first start out, everything's brand new and it feels so confusing and then later on... Usually when I play a game, I suddenly, like, know where everything is and I go, Oh, this is where I got lost, you know, that first time or that second time. But some games, like this one, I never identify where that spot was. <laughs> like, right now I'm having that. I don't think I'm ever going to identify where that spot was. Alright, let's go ahead and I think that's the best idea. I'm going to do a hard save right before we give this to Grub. Because we can definitely go ahead and make our beagle and shield. I don't necessarily know that what Grob has for us is going to be better than that. Let's go ahead and add it here. Alright, hard save time. Let's do a hard save quick. And then, um, I guess we're doing it down there. I don't know what I just saved over, but I don't think it matters. Okay.
okay. Well, big light breaches actually might not be a bad idea. Cause let's see, what were the leggings I was currently wearing? Uh was I still wearing the Wedgwood pants? No way. I think I was. I was still wearing the Wedgwood pants. So yeah, that's a huge upgrade. Um so yeah, I guess we'll keep that. So the only thing we don't have then is the Beagle Light. We can still make a Beagle Light shield, but we just don't have the Beagle Light. Alright, so I think what we'll have to do, because the problem is I still need Beagle Light either way, and I still need to find those orbs. I have just been running into orbs randomly. Like, I feel like at this point I've been most places. So I couldn't tell you if there's anywhere new I haven't explored yet. Uh, I have no idea where I would find more orbs. No idea whatsoever. So I think what I'll do in the meantime is just I get fully energized, run around a little bit, I guess, and look for more sources of beagle lights, and then maybe I will figure out whether or not I can manage to get that whole armor set. I... I feel so motivated <laughs> to finish this outfit now. I gotta be honest, I don't know what to do. Alright, well, let me look around for some Beagle Light. I assume that if I go into some roads less traveled, maybe I'll find some. I'm finding dull rock, so... Alright, give me a little bit, guys. I'll be back. here welcome back to more pine we're gonna go ahead and just jump right back into it so I'll see you guys back in just a second hey everyone Amber from the vault here welcome back to more pine we're gonna go ahead and jump in but real quick I just wanted to send out a huge thank you to Twirlbound who gave me a copy of this so I could play it for you guys thank you so much for that I really do appreciate it I am having a blast I will admit I'm getting towards the end of the game and I'm starting to get nervous because I'm not sure how this is gonna end and I'm afraid that it's my fault so we're gonna go ahead and get back into it guys and I'll see you in just a sec Hey everyone, Amber from the Vault here. Welcome back to more Pine. We're going to go ahead and just jump right back in, so I'll see you back in a sec. <laughs> 